Storm sounds pretty bad outside. Yeah, it does, but it's pretty far away. We still got some time. Wait, how do you know that? Well, sound travels at a slower rate than light does through the air, so. Oh, okay, so that's why you see lightning before you hear thunder. Exactly. The time it takes the thunder sound of lightning to reach us is a rational function. So the time it takes for that sound to get to us is inversely proportional to the temperature of the air outside. Wow, that's a pretty interesting equation. Mm -hmm. So that's why when it's warm outside, sound travels faster through the air. Right. And so when it's warm out, sound moves more quickly. And when it's cold out, sound moves more slowly. Have you ever noticed how things sound differently on a cold day? Now that you mention it, yeah, it is quieter when it's cold out. Mm-hmm. So we can use this equation to figure out how far the lightning is, or d, in the equation. Oh, and we can use the stopwatch to measure the time. Got it. And we can use this thermometer right here to measure the temperature outside. OK, so we will then solve for the distance of the equation. So 20 and 2.9, let's see here. OK, so that is 994.7 meters. Roughly one kilometer, so I was right. We do have time to get ready. Phew. <laughs> but wait, the graph has an asymptote at negative 551.7. Uh, Celsius. So, what do we do then? Well, first of all, we'd be frozen solid at that temperature. Ooh, ouch. And secondly, that temperature doesn't exist in nature. The coldest temperature in the universe is negative 273.15 degrees Celsius. Cold. That's absolute zero. That's cold. Yeah. The graph should end at absolute zero. All right, so we figured out all the calculations. So what do we do next? Well, according to the Government Ready Program, we need to make sure that we are indoors or within a vehicle. Oh, we're inside. OK, check. Check. We also need to make sure that we have secured all the doors and windows to the best of our ability. OK, I'm going to close the soundstage window then, OK? OK. <laughs> soundstage window closed. Good job. Thank you. <laughs> Next, we need to make sure that we unplug all of our electrical equipment. Hold on a second. You're saying no TV, then? Yeah. Bummer. No. And lastly, we need to make sure that we have an emergency kit on hand. With a storm like this, the power can be knocked out of all of our homes. OK, well, sounds like we're pretty ready. Yeah, yeah, sounds like we are. Ooh. OK, there. Let's see. 617.4, it's moving in fast. Well, you know what? If we think rationally, we'll have absolute zero trouble. <sighs> Don't leave me alone in here, please. 